Tonight, the Olathe School District canceled two football games due to COVID-19 exposure. Both games involved Shawnee Mission schools who were celebrating homecoming. 41 Action News reporter Ariel Rothfield shows us how Shawnee Mission scrambled to save the game and a high school tradition. Even with the game being last minute, parents and fans for both teams came out to show their support on what had been a whirlwind of a day. The stands were supposed to be empty, the football field cleared, and the Northwest Cougars were not expected to be here for another two weeks. But it's 2020, and Nancy Hinkey knows things change. The roller coaster. So excited to be here tonight, watching both schools. The Shawnee Mission School District pulling a Hail Mary. Touchdown, Cougars! Clearing the hurdle of COVID-19 for a historic night, an inter-district matchup with not just one, but two homecomings. It's, you know, tradition, and I'm just so grateful that we got to get it in, that we get to do the court announcement, get to have just a little bit of normalcy on what's been a super crazy year. Shawnee Mission Northwest was scheduled to play Olathe Northwest until they were informed one of Olathe's players tested positive for COVID-19. We started looking for football games. There's been a lot of people in the Kansas City area that have reached up to try to help us find a game. We came up dry across the board. But then the Olathe School District canceled the Olathe South game for the same reason. A player tested positive, according to the Shawnee Mission Northwest Athletic Director. Unfortunately, we don't have the revenue that the NFL has, you know, so we've got to go with what we have. We've got to be very, very careful. So under the Friday night lights. There were masks and social distancing, homecoming celebrations for the home team, as well as the team away, and a sense of normalcy for Nancy Hinkey, who cheered on her son. Pass complete to Hinkey. We've been really concerned whether he'd even get to play football. So we're really appreciative of the Shawnee Mission School District for working out ways to let us play play ball. Reporting in Kansas City, Ariel Rothfield, 41 Action News.